Remember the alien from Alien? A team of designers spent a lot of time and money inventing the creature that would go on to terrorise people throughout the movie franchise. But really, science fiction writers have no need to spend hours scratching their heads trying to come up with bizarre ideas for outlandish animals. A whole stack of them existed in the oceans right here on Earth during the Cambrian period, approximately 500 million years ago. The Burgess Shale is a famous fossil deposit site in the province of British Columbia in Western Canada, where tens of thousands of the remains of Cambrian creatures were discovered in 1909 by paleontologist Charles Walcott. It eventually proved to be one of the most significant fossil deposit sites on Earth. The fossil discoveries were brought to the public's attention in 1989 with the publication of Stephen Jay Gould's book, Wonderful Life. And now, we're going to bring a couple of the more interesting specimens to your attention. Starting with this. I mean seriously, look at that thing, it's just ridiculous. This is Anomalocaris, the T-Rex of the Cambrian period, reaching a length of about one metre. It had a mouth composed of a series of overlapping plates, like a pineapple ring with serrated prongs in its centre. Its close relative, Lagania, looks just as bizarre, although it was much smaller in size. Some scientists think Lagania may have been a kind of Cambrian whale, since it probably swam through clouds of zooplankton and allowed them to whoosh into its open mouth. So it probably wasn't the fearsome predator that a lot of artists think it was, although it wasn't exactly cute either. While we're talking about things with a weird mouth, just briefly, look at this. It's Opabinia. It has too many eyes and a mouth like a vacuum cleaner hose. Insane. Moving on, Morella splendens has a pretty sounding name, is 2 centimeters long, and is the most commonly found fossil in the Burgess Shale. Studies have shown that Morella was probably very colourful, though of course no one knows what the colours were, and so all the best illustrations of Morella are in black and white. How ironic. And last of all, the poster animal for the Burgess Shale, walking toothpick holder Hallucigenia. It was one of the most confusing animals found in the Burgess Shale deposits and still puzzles scientists to this day. No one can figure out which end is the head or which is the tail. They don't know if it eats with its feet or walks on the spines coming out of its back. Some paleontologists think Hallucigenia might even be just part of another bigger animal. Whatever the case may be, it's definitely a strange one. Of course, we've only had time to show you a brief snippet of the incredible life forms that existed during the Cambrian period. You can find out more information in Wonderful Life, or just ask Dr. Google. There's plenty of stuff on the internet.